what is happening my paris what is happening y'all blessed thursday evening to you all from our jamaica from my jamaican jamaican bedroom to where you all at blessed thursday evening what is happening no but i see in my bedroom not much now me and camera girl the camera girl in and say hi hi everyone so we are here and I'll smile for our face, pure teeth, teeth, so so teeth, because I'm here with her, she is celebrating and I'm here supporting her because we've got to love our kids, we've got to support our kids and I say to you all, love your kids no matter what, support your kids no matter what, it doesn't matter how rough doesn't matter how hard it gets support 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 your kids okay y'all so you want to tell me a little where you, where, where you celebrate she doesn't she's not gonna go in depth it is something to do with school and she doesn't want to go she's not really gonna but you know this is youtube and you got you know there are certain things in your life even though i want to share with you there are certain things that we want to keep private okay? you know you just have to know you go about things and all of that and so on you know so we just want to you know the debit debit strain it is about our lifestyle and all of that so you just want to briefly tell them what you're celebrating tell them tell the parties uh so i finally got my report because i'm in grade nine so there are certain criteria you'd have to meet to go to grade 10. if you don't really meet those criteria, then there are certain consequences that you'll have to face which face which aren't, aren't really good so Today, I have gotten my report, I saw the email, and I was happy to know and realize that I have met all the criteria and all the subjects that I wanted to do, I can get to do all of them, no problem. The subjects, are, yeah, to be clear, all the subjects that she wants to pursue it's, for CXC, yeah. she has gotten the go-ahead, she has worked, it's not that somebody give it to you, yeah. she has put in enough work. To be more than eligible to do so without asking for extra recommendations from teachers you gotta explain yourself. yeah yeah and so she come home and when she come home um the school sent it is she they send it by e via email to my email but i didn't know it was coming out like today but when she come she take up my phone she take up my phone she never met me look on it she got through it first so she, it has been like how many hours now and she can't stop celebrating well, she yeah. call her brother at work she tell her brother and he was elated him feel good and all of that and so forth and he promised to treat her and yeah, look forward to that treat yeah she feel good i've never seen her feel so good in such a long time and you know what happened we said we just want to share today i am so elated i'm so glad for her i'm so happy for her but at the same time she knows that she knows that it's the box doesn't stops here because it's got a lot a lot a lot of work i've been through it with my son but i'm not deterred i'm not scared because i was there for him and now it's even more stronger because she has her brother who has a degree he has a bachelor degree in business administration so she has her brother's support and family support count on me a degree you know my degree faded from 1983 and i'm gonna give you all that story one day yes i promise to drop that story maybe it can be told in one part on this debit Deb stream so you know what i'm about to say to you love your kids love them love your step kids it doesn't matter love the children them who come in and around your circle love them support them it doesn't matter what sometimes you know them now make the right decision we all know that as parents but guess what a lot of we never make the right decision back then you know so we gotta remember don't be hard on your kids you know support them help them to meet the milestones and have some time when they may reach it you are the ones that they have they have nobody else okay no but i met because your kid no meet it no auntie no uncle no grandmother no grandfather come beat up in a jamaica thing you know this is a jamaica thing come batter batter up them mouth pan them come beat up beat up them mouth pan them no 
do what you gotta do support them love them be there for them okay y'all i'm saying to you love them treat them well and i'm not simply meaning your personal biological children only love everybody's kids that come around your circle don't ever say anything bad about other people's children in a matter all when them i say bad things about your kids them you don't do it you know they are the future they need love they need support don't beat up no make nobody beat up on your pin of them and that is a jamaican patwa thing it simply means don't let anybody beat up on your kids and you not beat up on nobody picking they love the kids love them do for them look out for them it doesn't matter doesn't matter because let me tell you i am speaking to you all from experience i know what it is as a child to be beaten been beaten upon i know it as if no one else would know it i have been there and as i said to you one day one day i will give you maybe not all not sure how much i'll go but i'll give you a part of it and on the subject of that that journey that i did as a child being beaten upon I, it has led me over the decades, not even years, the, the years has turned into decades to write a book. And at, at this, until this point, I'm sitting and looking in this camera. It's a burning issue inside of me to write a book. So any of you all out there watching this little video vlog, it's not a vlog, it's just a sit down video. Know the first, I know what I want to do. I know that I have the contents because it's a part of my journey I am not sure how do I start I have the information there are some things I need to be guided so to speak you're you all out there who have written in here you have written a book already you know the first step or the first set of steps to take comment below if you have been beaten upon as a kid you have been torn apart dreams have been shattered comment below comment 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 okay y'all so this as we're here talking we're under sharing with her we're sitting here and she come for she's she's so excited she's so elated she don't even want food but you know what i'm elated too i'm excited so i'm i'm excited as well so you know upon the train yeah, you know what we plan to share as we go along on the debit train we plan to share and all of that so we just want to say to you what well, you want to say to them camera girl as a young person um, as a child you want to speak to the parents say something to them i would like to say from my experience and bigger persons as well yes children will make mistakes everyone has made mistakes but what you have to do is learn from your mistakes and encourage people or encourage your child to say all right you made a mistake you know that what you have to do better what have to change that 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 don't you know beat up on the kid because when you beat up on them then that will lessen their self-esteem and it doesn't work out there's no there's not much positivity coming from that so what you have to do is encourage them whatever good or bad you encourage them to do better and if they have done good as well you congratulate them and encourage them to do even better because you know they can succeed and you know that they can be good and in a nutshell no matter what no matter what love your kids and i'm gonna leave you with that love your kids don't let anybody beat up on your children don't let it doesn't matter what love them support them support them to in as much as you can because i'm telling you i'm gonna tell you again it's not nice when you're being beaten upon and i had a mom but my mom was fine she was okay because i had to leave where i was as a child to come to, to leave i had to leave the rural part to come to the city and they assured my mom that everything would be okay and that they would take care but i wasn't taken care of but 
you know, being a little pitney, you know, want to go back in the rural area. You, you know, tell your mother because my mother was such a person that she would just worry to death. And as I said to you, one day I'm just gonna keep the rest. I'll just let you all know. I, I, I'm just, I'm gonna come with it, but the time is not right as yet. So we're gonna leave you once more, and you know our thing. Stay blessed, love yourselves first, love your kids, support all the kids, not only yours, but all children that come around within your circle of life. Support them, love them, do the best you can do for them. And we're going to leave that train here again. We have a lock off that little train engine here till when we see you again. And you know, as always, I leave you with this never let the evil around you take control of you evil can never prevail over good steer pantapatings bless love you bye love you all bye